Welcome to the Maths Made Easy tutorial on powers and roots. So in this video we're going to go through a few more laws, starting with the power zero law. So uh, the power zero law is pretty simple, it's anything to the power zero, so for instance x to the zero is equal to one. It doesn't matter what you have, it could be pi to the power zero is equal to one, it could be 500 to the power zero, that's equal to one, it could be minus 10 to the power zero, it's equal to one. Whatever you have to the power zero is always going to be equal to one. Moving on then, we have a simple one again here. This is the power one law. So this means that anything to the power one is just itself. So x to the one is equal to x. 500 to one is equal to 500. Pi to the power one equals pi. Uh, you can extend this forever. Anything to the power one is just itself. So finally then, the last rule that we'll look at in this video is the one law. So this applies to the number one. So if we have one to the power anything, it's always going to be equal to one. So it could be one squared, which is equal to one. It could be one cubed, which is equal to one. One to the minus five is equal to one. One to the one million, guess what that is equal to? Also one, and it could also be uh, decimals. So for instance, 0 0.5. So one to the power anything is always equal to one. If you're feeling good about this topic and you want to practice some exam style questions, you can do so with our online exam. This is available through our revision platform and if you take the test you'll find loads of different questions to have a go at, all of which are instantly marked so you can keep track of where you're going wrong and where you can improve for your exam. So if you're interested you can click the link below and it will take you straight there.